She just said, come with me. I'm going to go to spin class tomorrow. I said, okay, I'll come. I'll come to your spin class. I've never done this before. But I went. This soul cycle, whatever it is, right? Yeah, see, everybody gets all hopped up. I go to the one in LA, everybody's fake positive, right? They come into the class, what's going on? How's it going? Are we gonna do this today? Okay, relax, relax. It's a class. It's a spin class. So right away, I'm bothered. I go, babe, I gotta get out of here. I can't, I can't do this already. I'm upset. She's like, come on, let's go check in and get our shoes. I said, shoes? What is this, bowling alley? <laughs> Everybody's got these special spin shoes, so they're all walking around. <laughs> I'm on bike 22, could you tell me where bike? Okay, it's over here, great. So we signed up late. My wife and I did not have bikes together. My wife starts panicking. She's like, babe, we're not doing this together. I'm on the other side of the room. I have to ask the girl next to you. I go, don't, babe, don't, don't, do, don't start doing this shit. The girl next to me is already set up. She's got a water bottle, everything's in place. Do not ask her anything. I go, babe, we're not gonna talk during this. It's a 45 minute class. We're not gonna like, I'm not gonna turn to you and go, did you pay the gas bill? I, this is a workout. We're not gonna hold hands on the bike. This is not a ride through Central Park. This is a stationary bike. So I start the workout. The, the, the class didn't even start. I just start in on my own thing. I ain't waiting. If I'm there, let's get the thing going. I'm cooking. <laughs> so now the teacher comes in. This guy was way too happy for what was happening in the room. <laughs> it's one of these like real positive teachers. He's like, all right, everybody. You ready? It's a Monday morning. Put your head down. Let's get rid of that mean boss that keeps bitching at you every time you come in. Let's get rid of that debt that you have. Let's shed that that cousin that didn't come to the holiday dinner. I'm like, gee, how bad is it in here for these people? I'm just here to get rid of the cheesecake I had last night, not the abusive father. What the hell is going on? But my wife grew up like very athletic. She grew up in a family where they, they just, they have a lot of time on that side. They got a lot of money. So nobody's doing anything really, you know? <laughs> Everybody's really relaxed. Like when I went over there for the first time, I was meeting my, my wife's family and like, like everybody was home. <laughs> like on a Tuesday at 2.30, I go, why is everybody home? <laughs> like no one works over there. They just, you know, I, I'm like, what does your cousins do? Really, I don't uh, really know what they do. I think they're in advertising, but I don't really know what they do. They're so relaxed. They're the type of family that when they graduated college, they took a year off to go find themselves. <laughs> do you know people like this? They graduate and they go backpacking through Europe and stay at hostels like they're broke. <laughs> they go find themselves. That shit don't fly on my side. <laughs> when I graduated college, I couldn't tell my father, Dad, I'm gonna go to Europe to go find myself. <laughs> what do you mean, go find yourself? <laughs> I found you, you're right here in my house. <laughs> Where are you gonna go? <laughs> you wanna see you? Go look in the mirror. You got no job and you're in my house. I found you. You're here.